Derp-a-derp-a-derp. It's up there. So I've got to get up there. Um, yeah, I got told about this um, yesterday. Come on, let me up. Um, apparently, yeah, the secret exit is supposed to be up there, but I need to have a running start, and I'm not getting a running start. So, come on, let me up. Oh, why am I failing this so badly? This is not hard in the slightest. There we go. Yeah, look at that door. You know, just appearing there, out of nowhere. Yep, it's a Marlboro shortcut. That's kind of what I thought, but, you know, we have to get it anyway. So, yeah. Marlboro shortcut, everybody. Haha, <laughs> we're flowers that just stay there. So, hey guys, this is Gamer Cow, and we just found ourselves a Marlboro shortcut. And that's gonna take us beyond the castle, which is kind of what I thought. But, um, yeah, it takes us to a buried cave, and I don't really want to go to a buried cave at the moment, so we'll just go and do the castle instead. Yeah, this is being played on my old laptop, so I'm hoping the, um, the audio desync type stuff doesn't happen here, but, um, you know, we'll just take it as it comes, that's kind of the way that it has to happen, but I don't remember ever having audio desync troubles with my laptop before. So, yeah, okay, um, is the head of- oh, right, yeah, okay, I get what he's meaning now, it means that- are we lucky? Well, no, we're not, so let's just hope we get this right. Oh, Jesus, right, P-Switch. Um, I don't like it when I can't see the stuff that's going on. Um, okay, uh, ow. So, let's see, I think I know what this is for. We have, this one is a different color, so, there we go, that's what we needed to do. Yeah, I could see the base of that one was a different colour, so... We missed a thing, and it's gonna be a take a guess type root thing. And of course we guessed wrong. No, that's bullshit. Sorry, I'm not taking that one. There is no difference in the two routes, and... Wow. Is there? Um... Well, one coin is rotating the opposite way around, if I'm looking at this right. Let's see if that works for here, too. Um... One of the coins looks like it's the opposite way around. And that does appear to be the solution for it. Right, okay, so I'm gonna take it then. And I'll be back in a second because I kind of... It's kind of cheap then, if there is an actual solution to it, then, you know, we'll go with it. Of course, you could just memorize the pattern as well, but it wouldn't be quite so fun that way. So, um, so that's the game we're going to play then, is it? We're going to have to be super massively observant for this. Uh, well, I can deal with that. It's just not really what I'd like to do, I guess. Um, it's not too bad though, I think. I think there is, um, probably enough clues for this to be okay, so, god, um, I kind of knew that was going to happen. I have no idea how I would have gotten around that. Okay, so what's the deal with this? Um, I can see different shades down below, so I'm assuming they're bottom bottomless pits. And we're just going to, you know, run over that. That really wasn't too hard, and that's the midpoint right there, so, you know, we're good to go with that. Um... Kind of hoping that's the way the rest of this goes, actually, because this would be pretty good if that's the way it is. Even if you can enter my room, I'm not in the castle. Oh, well, great. Um, okay, fair enough. We're gonna have to go anyway, though, so, whoa, okay. So, is this gonna be a guess the route type of thing? Is there any visual clue for this one? Because I'm not seeing it, and... Oh boy, uh, remember the route that you took? Where's the fire? Um, right, let's go up, and up again, and yep, okay, oh, Jesus, um, oh, I thought that was safe for some reason. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not really staying very much here, I know that, but, um, it's kind of hard to really, um, save very much to it when you get trapped like that. Yeah, that was not very good. Ah. 
Okay, see, that wasn't too hard. Um, we don't even have to deal with the, you know, fire anymore. Yeah, the, I guess there's one slight problem with the, um, the whole thing of this. Oh, there's the end. Uh, yeah, there's the one problem with doing this on my old laptop, is that my old laptop's not as good for recording stuff, but it doesn't quite have the, um, it doesn't quite have as good a processor and, well, set processes and whatnot, so um, it will probably lag a little bit more doing it on here, but um, it's not lagging very much, if at all. We got full 8 lives, fantastic. Yay, live, 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 yay, we just like lives. Um, yeah, we're liking them so much, we're jumping right for them. Okay, but it does make it easier though, because if I'm recording it on my old laptop, it means I don't have to transfer any files across. And, okay, so now we have the real castle over here. That's kind of an odd level design set, but we'll happily deal with that, that's quite cool actually. Um, oh, this on the other hand, maybe not quite so. Well, I mean, it's not too bad, you just have little hops to do. It's done, Naku Fire! Um, yeah. Yes, we are a pest, and yes, we will settle it once and for all, because you are going down, boy. Um, okay, so, is this uh, it's another maze-type thing? Um, oh, isn't this going to be wonderful? Uh, Jesus Christ. Um, I honestly don't quite know where I'm going with all of this, and that's not good. Um, half of what I think is solid is actually not solid. That's a bit lame, to be honest. But it's Roy, that's it, the game is over. You suck, so just die for us, why don't you? Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah, Roy, but well, all of the vanilla bosses, really, when they're just done like that, they're not very tough at all, so, you know, it's, it's dead easy to do, you know. Luigi still looks weird there, but what can you do, eh? Okay, so that is apparently the sick peg, even though we're only done World 5. I still don't get that, I haven't looked back and seen if we got any extra eggs, but it doesn't look like it. Uh, yep. And apparently, yeah, we're on for the last one. Did we get two in the first world? Because I remember the first world was really long, so it's highly possible, but I just don't remember. And there we go, the buried cave is there, so that's why I didn't do it earlier. <laughs> okay, so let's have a look see what the buried cave is like. Um, well, burying a cave must be quite kind of hard to do, you know, because caves are already by definition buried since they're underground, so, you know, it's quite a challenge doing that. Um, I kind of knew that was coming, you know, that one was pretty obvious. There's not much of a reason that you would put something like that there. So, Rugby Chuck, what are you doing here, you know? You shouldn't be out here, it's a cave and stuff, it's not good, and there's something down there, so... I was kind of thinking, you know, that might have been the compulsory way to go, but apparently not, so we'll just go down there now and see what it's like. Well, there's a fish, you know, if you like fish, and... Well, fish are pretty cool. You know, fish make good meals as well, so, yeah. I don't know about these ones making good meals, because I haven't exactly tried to eat one of these fish, but, um, you know, fish in general is a good meal. I kind of like fish, so... Yeah, random trivia for the day, right there, you know, sliding into nothingness. <laughs> well, we're not exactly sliding into nothing, but we're definitely still sliding, so... Eh. What can you do, Cooperman? What can you do? I don't know why I'm stealing a shell, actually. Okay, so what's going on here? Clearly we're missing a P-switch if we're going to progress, but, um... Where is it? Can we oh, we can go here. <laughs> what a dirk out. Um, that was kind of obvious, wasn't it? <laughs> okay, so... I'm trying to grab the piece of which I have no idea if I'm going to need it, but, you know, it's always fun to, um, quote-unquote, break these things. So let's just see if we can use this piece of which anywhere. Um, probably not by the looks of it, so we're probably just going to ditch it, because it's going to be a lot of effort trying to keep hold of this thing, so... Yeah, 
don't know quite if it's worth it, so let's get rid of it. You know, you can stay there for all eternity, I don't care. Um, in fact, no, you can get... Did I just... No, I did not just screw myself up. <laughs> Thank God for that, I would have been really nasty if I'd have been managed to mess up that because of a, um, you know, taking a P-switch through a pipe type thing. Oh well, whatever, we don't really need it anyway. That was that was kind of a cool session. It was a bit pointless, but still kind of cool. And there was the midpoint down there, so that is a fire armament for ourselves, you know, that's always good. Artillery can use flamethrower as well, by the way, just in case you forgot that. <laughs> Random fact of the day. Um, yeah, oh, why did I go upwards there? That was clearly not going to work. You silly cow. And you're not quite so silly, but you're a bat, so, you know. Yeah, so I'm gonna get lag if I do it on this computer, but if it's, you know, lag instead of desync, I don't know what's actually better, but, um, probably desync, to be honest, because if I can play with, um, without lag, we can build a bridge. You know, that's how lagless games work. They can build bridges, and that was kind of incredibly lucky, actually, but, um, nah, I don't know if it was as much luck as pretty much planned, but, you know, it could have easily messed me up. Oh god, right, so, pipe maze, and I heard that coming down, so you can just, you know, go and screw yourself over, because I don't care. Okay, so, kill the spike top, thank you very much. That was very nice of you, Cooper dude, because that spike top would have been a pain in the ass to get around. And we have ourselves a springboard, which we need to get the silver P, which we need to get this normal P, which we need to progress. Yeah, good old, like, not a well it is a maze, isn't it really, but we're running out of time, so I guess I better actually hurry this up a little bit. And, yep, silver P, and there's the normal one down here, so let's hurry on, hurry on, hurry on. Because I do not want to run out of time on this sort of level, because it's really not that hard. Um, dive away, and just rush with this thing going on. Why do we have to take so long going through this pipe thing? Honestly, this is kind of annoying. I don't know if I'll need the springboard, but I want to take it anyways, so, you know, we'll, um, we'll see. If nothing else, it'll give me a, um, extra fire flower at the end here. That was kind of what I was expecting, to be honest, but, yeah. So, actually, so far, I'm pretty pleased with this. This is, um, this is going well, and these levels are not bad at all. You know, to be perfectly honest, these are getting much better. Hopefully that's the way it's gonna stay. You know, I'm gonna do one more level in this, and that will be that. So, Deep Mountain. You know, blindness at the start, but it's not anything difficult. Uh, no way out to... what? Well, yeah, okay. Um, I actually didn't pay too much attention to that, but... Yeah. Pretty much we're going downhill. You know? But, where are we going down the hill? Um... Are we going up this way? No, seriously, what are we supposed to be doing here? Um... Um... Let's pay a bit more attention to this, then. Uh... Trench and use shortcut on the ground? Well, yeah, but... Where are we supposed to be going down the hill? Am I gonna have to take another, like, time out to search for what we're supposed to be doing here? Because that would be kind of crap. Um... Honestly, I do not see what is going on. Um... No, really, what the hell? Um... Um... This is not the first time I've done this in recent videos, is it? Uh... What are we supposed to do? There's nothing. Ah... Uh, what? Okay, I'm gonna be back if I find this out. Honestly, what? I don't understand what's going on here. Nope, there's nothing here. I've looked absolutely everywhere, there is nothing here, so... Video over, I'm afraid. Sorry guys, 